Accessing AMS and the Marking Review Dashboard. Recommended browsers are Internet Explorer 11 and Google Chrome with pop-ups enabled for PC users. And for Mac users, they should use Google Chrome with the pop-ups enabled also. Using the most recent version of a recommended browser will provide the optimal user experience. Access AMS via My Glasgow. Select Assessment from the Services menu following Login. You will see a list of the exams for which you are Course Coordinator, First Marker or Second Marker. If any are missing, please contact your Programs Administrator. Click on the Select link for the exam to access the Marking Review Dashboard. Click on the Select link for the exam to access the Marking Review Dashboard. Following the return of all marking packs, answer sheets will be scanned and program administrators will review the data and resolve anomalies. They will then contact first markers who will complete the following task via AMS. 1. Review exam statistics and distribution. 2. Add comments to exam answers for attention of second marker if required. 3. Complete your section of the marking review form. 4. Complete generic feedback. 5. Confirm that first marking is complete. 6. Email second marker to initiate second marking process. Steps 3 and 4 should be completed by each first marker for exams with marking teams. First marker task. Review statistics. Review your exam statistic using the filter button to view histogram and statistics by marker in question. Identify marker issues. If the marking review raises any issues, you can make changes to first marking grades or add notes to alert the second marker. This should be done on an exceptional basis and must be noted in the marking review form. Click on Answer to view the answer sheet and Grade to view the update grade screen. To change a grade, enter the new grade in the Marker 1 box and add a comment to indicate the reason. Click on Update to save your changes and leave the screen. Click on Refresh page to update the histogram. On the marking review table, you will see that the new grade is highlighted in red because it differs from the scan grade as is the second marker grade as they are no longer in agreement pending second marking review. The marking review screen will be displayed for you to add on your commentary. Note that you have 30 minutes to update the form before it will time out. The form is locked and cannot be accessed by other users until the time you until either you time out or update the form to exit. You can view an export of this form which will compile all entries in the output section. You must click on the refresh page button to populate it and may have to enable editing in Excel to view this. Please do not edit this document. Your amendments will not be saved. To update the generic feedback, click on generic, Update Generic Feedback. Click on the button to access the screen and add text. Generic feedback is often based on the marking review commentary, but edited for its student's audience. Note that you have 30 minutes to update the form before it will time out. The form is locked and cannot be accessed by other users until you time out or update the form to exit. You can view an export of this form complete with histogram in the output section. You must click on the refresh page button to populate it and may have to enable editing in Excel to view this.
please do not edit this document. Your amendments will not be saved. Once you have confirmed that your marking is complete, click on the complete first marking box. When all first markers have ticked the box, the date in the actual column will populate. Email second markers to initiate the second marking process. Click on the button to access the pre-populated message and add any further com information you would like to flag to the second marker. Upon receipt of the email, you should complete the following tasks as a second marker. 1. Review exam statistics and distribution. Review sample of exam answers and agree suggest amendments to grades, making notes to explain basis of disagreement. 3. Complete your section of the marking review form. 4. Confirm that second marking is complete. 5. Email first marker only if there are academic staff or adjunct staff with overall responsibility for the assessment. Review exam statistics using the filter button to view histogram and statistics by marker and question. A sample has been pre-selected at question level to reflect the distribution of grades across questions and markers. It has also includes all marginal fields. You can elect to second mark beyond the sample. In the event that any of the samples are particularly difficult to read, you can substitute this for another question with the same grade or as close to the same grade as possible by ticking and ticking the checkbox. You can also review additional student work beyond the sample to ensure consistency. In the marking review table, you will see that there is a tab for each question and the second marker is named. For each, you may wish to order by second marker if there is more than one. Please check to ensure that the sample does not exceed beyond page one. To view the sample and create an audit trail, click on answer to view the answer sheet and grade to view the updates grade screen. The default second marker grade in the marker two block is the same as the, sang, as the sang, scanned grade. Normally the, also the same as the first marker grade unless they have made a change which, be, which would be flagged on the list. If you are satisfied with the first marker's grade Click update to log the agreement and leave the screen. To suggest a different grade, replace the grade in the marker 2 box and add a comment to indicate the reason. This if you have signal disagreement with the first marker but you have overall responsibility for the marking and will not discuss further with the first marker, you should also enter the agreed grade. On the marking review table, you will see that the new grade 2 is highlighted in red and a notes flag has been added. Where you have made no changes, you will now see that an agree grade is logged. If you suggest changes, click on the refresh page to update the statistics. When you have completed second marking, click on the update marker review button to access the screen. The marking review screen will be displayed for you to add commentary. Select the second marker review tab. 
Note that you have 30 minutes to update the form before it will time out. The form is locked and cannot be accessed by other users uh, until you time out or update the form to exit. You can view and export of this form which will compile all entries in the output sections. You must click on the refresh page to populate it and we have to enable editing in Excel to review this. Please do not edit this document as your amendments will not be saved. Click on the Update Generic Feedback button to access the screen and review edit the text. Generic feedback is often based on the marking review comment but edited for its students' audiences. You can view an update of this form complete with histogram in the output section. You must click on the refresh page to populate it and may have to enable editing in Excel to view this. Please don't amend this document as it will your amendments will not be saved. To confirm that second marking is complete, tick the box. When all second markers have ticked the box, the date in the actual column will populate. Email first markers to confirm second marking is complete. Click on the button to access the pre-populated message and add any further information that you would like to flag to the first marker. This step is not necessary if as second marker you have overall responsibility for the assessment. You should now proceed to finalise the grades. Finalising grades via AMS. Once second marking is complete, grades can be finalised. Joint second markers should identify a lead marker or work together to complete the relevant tasks. 1. Agree suggestion to grade changes. Consider wider implications arising from grade suggestions made by second markers and make further revisions as required. Click on the refresh page to update the statistics. Edit, finalise the marking review form and generic feedback. 5. Confirm that marking is complete and grades are final at this stage by ticking the tick box. Grades finalised. After you have done this, you should email the program's administrator to confirm that marking is complete.